Hey everyone, welcome back to Apple Seeds. Now that summer is well and truly underway, we've got some incredible squash plants growing. Look at these leaves, aren't they huge? And these blossoms here, these are all gonna turn into squash and zucchini plants, and you can eat the blossom. Now I know squash can be a little bit scary if you don't know how to cook it, but I'm gonna show you a really fun and simple way to do it. Let's get going. So now that we've got our gorgeous squash, we've got our olive oil, our salt, our pepper, and our garlic powder. We're ready to get going. So you can dice squash pretty much any way you want. I prefer mine in half moons. So we're gonna cut the end off and then we're gonna cut it in half straight down the middle. And then that way you can just kind of go down the line and cut it and you'll have a flat surface to work with, just like that. So you want it in little kind of quarter inch pieces. You want them all cut kind of evenly so that they cook at the same rate. So squash is really cool and zucchini because it's full of fiber, which helps your digestive system. And it's also one of the world's oldest crops. It's estimated to be over 10,000 years old. And even George Washington grew it in his garden. Okay, now that all of our squash is cut, we're gonna throw it in a bowl, coat it with olive oil, add our salt, pepper, and garlic powder. And just toss it all together. Whoops. <laughs> Probably should have used a bigger bowl. My bad. <laughs> All right, now let's put it on our sheet tray. All right. So I'm just gonna spread these out a little bit, try to make sure they're not overlapping so that they don't get mushy. And then we're just gonna pop it in the oven. All right, so we've already preheated our oven to 400 degrees, so I'm just gonna pop these in and then we'll come back and check them in 10 minutes. Take a look at this. Doesn't this look so good? See this brown on top? That's where the natural sugars in the zucchini and the squash started to caramelize. So we put this in the oven for 10 minutes and then we flipped it and cooked it for another 10 and just kept an eye on it until we started to get this nice golden brown color. Let's give it a try. Mm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Squash everything you thought you knew about squash. This is incredible. It would be a perfect side dish for any sort of outdoor event, any summer picnic, barbecue, anything you've got going on. You could add it to pasta sauce, you could put it on top of rice. Squash goes with everything. And it's so good. So this is a really tasty and simple recipe. I hope you make it at home. See you next time. If you enjoyed this video, you should subscribe to Appleseeds on YouTube for more recipes and fun on the farm.